You know, the original Stormtrooper design came from uh, uh, Tupperware. <laughs> <laughs> Tupperware? Uh, do back. back in with a new video. I, I love it, man. George Lucas is staying very active in the reaction community. We got his reaction from Star Wars 9, the final trailer. Now he did a final reaction to The Mandalorian. So let's get right into it. New videos every day. Hit the bell, hit the sub. Let's go. George Lucas, creator of Star Wars. And What's up, George? Collider reaction videos. He still has the green I screen. I afford to make this one, so I financed it. And now I got roped into this shit. <laughs> so I guess these are the experimental films I'll be making for the rest of my life. Nice. There we go. Another bastardization of my great work. What kind of shoes does he have on? You know, the original Stormtrooper design came from uh, uh, Tupperware. <laughs> <laughs> Tupperware? Uh, these do-backs. You know, all you guys are going to give me back in, you know, 97 when I did the special edition. So, oh, it doesn't move, move like that. It's like they're in a, in a goddamn marathon. Oh, George. The whole Mandalorian armor comes from the uh, Star Wars holiday special. The, uh, Boba Fett first made his appearance riding on a sea creature. Oh, there's Daddy's name. Look at that. <laughs> right when the Lucasfilm logo shines, Wado gets his wings. <laughs> That's that, that's that sort of rhino creature from the uh, prequels, the Reek. I'll tell you what reeks, this trailer. This trailer? Yeah, this is all the same. You know, it's just deserts and people with capes. That's IG-11, not IG-88. Because if you call him IG-88, then daddy gets a million dollars. <laughs> 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 oh, this is you know, it's a lot of pressure. This is the first Star Wars series to come out on Disney+. Plus. Hopefully Favreau doesn't fuck it up. Well, the trailer is competent, you know, it's technically well Talk made. about Favreau. I was actually on the set of Mandalorian uh, for a few days, and I would play little pranks like, you know, take a sh behind one of the set pieces, you know, just kind of my way of keeping myself I guess when you got all that money. The idea about the Mandalorian was something that originated from the Star Wars holiday special. I tried to bring it back and explore it in the prequels. Ultimately, we had to cut out all the Chewbacca scenes on Kashyyyk uh, with, you know, his wife Mala. And, yep, uh, that's true, son, with the Christmas special. Uh, lumpy. The important thing about Jango Fett and Boba Fett is that they have a New Zealand accent. You know, that's why I went back to the special editions and changed Boba Fett's accent so that it sounded more like it was New Zealand. Well, I guess that's it for me, guys. Tune in next time when I do a reaction video entirely from the toilet. <laughs> George is so savage. <laughs> well, there we have it. George Lucas blessing us with his presence once again <laughs> for the mandalorian hey guys i mean it's star wars season right now if you're a star wars fan this is the best time we got the new comics coming out we got of course nine coming out and of course the mandalorian looks amazing as well so hey post down in the comments below did you enjoy the george lucas deep fake impersonation uh right here i have the other reaction uh for his episode nine trailer of me laughing my butt off to that so check that out and hey new reactions every single day uh join us for, uh for the journey we're trying to get to that 1k subscriber goal i would love it if you guys would join us uh so i'll see you in the next video and be easy